move it to the P I N Y. to introduce you to someone who might just be the next mini Annie Summers. Ah, uh, boo, boo. Oh, for crying out loud. Hmm. Crying out loud is what they do on soap operas. Huh? Hey, you make a better door than you make a window. <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh. Oh. Careful, sweetheart. Oh, gee, that was close. Thanks, Mr. Oh, just call me Joe. Nice to meet. Come on, Michelle. Hmm? Francesco's finally gonna tell Debbie the waitress that he loves her. Sorry, sir. I mean, Joe. Thanks again. No problem. <laughs> I want that stupid. Pink haired freak out of PINY. But Michelle, I mean, why don't you just ignore her? <laughs> don't you dare say that ever again, Dory. <laughs> we cannot allow that janitor girl to stay here. She's gonna ruin my life. And nobody ruins Julia Cooper's life. Well, I think we should. No. Huh? This time, we're gonna do something she'll never forget. What if we... No. Hmm? Hmm. I'm thinking more like... Hmm. Isn't that lemur the cutest? Michelle? Sorry, sir. I mean, Joe, right? Wait, how do you know my name? About that. Well, you're very famous at PINY. Seriously? Is that yours? <laughs> yeah, just some ideas. You know, my daughter likes design, too. You'd like her. <clears throat> <clears throat> it seems I have to get back to work. I enjoyed our little mm -hmm. chat, Michelle. I hope to see you again. Yeah, thanks. See you around. How is she adapting to the school? She's one of the best students we have here. You made a wise decision, mister. Please, Rania. We're friends. Call me Joe. <laughs> What's wrong with you? I don't think this is a good idea. Oh, please, don't be a chicken. Pick it up. Students of PINY, please be advised that several of the outside areas, including the sports field, will be closed for remodeling until further notice. I must emphasize that it is strictly forbidden to enter these areas during the construction period. No exceptions. Thank you for your attention. Carry on. Ugh, worst day ever. We're practically prisoners if we can't use the grounds. I thought you hated sports, Tosh. Duh, but how am I gonna show off my new sweatsuit now? I'm sure it's gonna look great in your closet, right next to all your other never-been-worn exercise clothes. Huh? What is... Meet me 
at the stables tonight before dinner. Well, I'll be. Hey, y'all. Looks like our girl's fixing for a date. You know it, girl. It's the power of love. What? No. And then I landed a kickflip. Don't worry, Dior. In a few days, you'll have your sweet home back. Stop it, Dory! He's our hostage! <gasps> Don't just stand there, Dory! Catch him! Don't let him escape! Julia? Ah! Huh? Huh? I have nothing to say to you. None of your business. Huh? If you're offering, I've got about a load and a half that needs washing. So, Mish, you ready for your big date? It's not a date. I mean, technically, it's not a date, right? <laughs> Have you seen Armando lately? I haven't seen him since yesterday. <sighs> Will? Is that you? This isn't funny. <laughs> Hmm? Armando, what have they done to you? <laughs> huh? <laughs> oh no, 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 no! This isn't good! <sighs> Come on, Daisy! <laughs> Mr. Fairchild, I just heard some awfully strange noises outside. Michelle? Hmm? What? Uh, what are you doing here? Dad, I... 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 This... Hmm? Oh. <gasps> Sorry. Please, Miss Fairchild, enough. Return to your room immediately. We will discuss this tomorrow. <sighs> in my office. Let me see! Hmm. We gotta go. I must admit, I'm very disappointed with Michelle's behavior. Under any other circumstances, I'd send her home. You should be thanking Mr. Cooper for continuing to support Michelle. Mr. Cooper? Of course. He's been generous enough to maintain Michelle's scholarship. Th thank you, Madam Forbes. Enough said. If you don't mind, I'm sure we both have other things which require our attention. Hello, Mr. Cooper? Is everything okay, Rania? Yes. 
I just wanted to inform you that, as you requested, Michelle may continue at PINY. However, I'm sure you understand that if any other incidents occurs, I will be forced to let her go. Of course. I hope it won't be necessary. Thanks for your understanding, Reyna. Hi, Mr. Cooper. Hello, girls. Daddy! <laughs> <laughs> hey, honey. Where have you been? I was looking all over for you. Oh, Daddy! You have to come see the most divine project I'm working on! that you guys have to spend this weekend with your family. Are you kidding? We'll be at the beach, toes in the sand, kayaking. Nothing special. Oh yeah, cause sitting here alone, staring at the wall is so special. Kayaking isn't that cool. Like water, oars, what's the big deal? Hey. <laughs> is something wrong? Howdy y'all, wanna join the lock-in tonight? Seriously, a flyer? What century do you think we're in? Mm. Hmm? Mm. Nice try, but it's still a no. In case you guys change your mm. mind. Mm. Ah. Don't even think about it. I wouldn't be caught dead at one of those kinds of parties. Why not? I'm telling you, stay away from that loony buffalo girl. If she senses some kind of friendship, You'll never get rid of her. See you, Michelle. Have fun all alone. I'm sure I'm not the only student spending the weekend alone. Huh? Mm -hmm. <sighs> well, looks like it's just you and me. Or just me. I bet the day can get even worse. Yep. Hey, Michelle. What's up? Uh, hi, Will. Um, what's up? Wow, Michelle. I see you're in the mood for mud. <laughs> Are you coming to my party tonight? We're gonna have video game battles. A party? I'd love... I'm sure she has plenty of other things to do. Will, hmm. why don't we... I'll be there for sure, but only if we're playing Lord Star Battle Royale 7. Bay, you're talking with the king of Westonia. <laughs> well, oh. I can get 12 stars in two levels, my dear king of Westonia. Seriously? I need to see this. Uh. Hey, Will, you know what? I'm the queen of fashion of wherever you said. <sighs> Lord of Stars, Battle Royale party tonight at the gym. Don't forget to wear your costume. Oh, this is gonna be awesome, Armando. I think I have the perfect outfit. Come on, Michelle, you own this. Wait, is that a stain? Ha, you took the bait, platy shell. Oh. Up. I shouldn't have let Tasha borrow my shoes. Get in the gym, dummy! Hmm? Ugh. Ha ha ha! Game over, Michelle. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh. Hi, Michelle. Glad to see you. 
Love the outfit. Hey, you. Um, have you seen Will? Oh, sure. Want some food? Uh, mm, thanks. Uh, maybe later. You know where I can find him? I'll go find him. Why don't you make yourself comfortable in the meantime? Sure. Thanks. Mm. Stella. Right. Stella. Uh. Uh. Oh, no! Hey, get out of my way, freaks! Nobody can leave the lock-in until Sunday. What? I am not going to stay here. Hmm. We got a 10.30 at the door. Out. Wait a second! I'm not even a part of this! Stop it! Wasn't this supposed to be a costume party? Hey, Michelle! Uh -huh. Where have you been hiding? It took me forever to finally find him, but... Here he is! But that's not Will. Actually, I'm Walter, Stella. I tried to tell you... Walter, Wally, Will... Who cares? At the end of the day, we're all human! Yeah, well... I should go find Will. Shoot, girl. Why don't you try and have some fun? The doors won't be open till Sunday. You're locked in. What? What do you mean, locked in? I'm supposed to be at Will's party. Hey, Will. Did you end up inviting Michelle? I don't see her anywhere. Sure. She must be around. I think I'll go look for her. Uh, what? <laughs> How did you do that, Dory? Uh, uh, please. Huh? This is an emergency. Please. Wow! <sighs> what is this? OMG, it's so cute! <clears throat> what? Either play or give it back. Is that the Kitty Cut Cat 2.0? Yeah, why? Well, let the Kitty Queen show you how it's done. I thought you might be hungry. Want to know a secret? These hamburgers ain't nothing compared to my Uncle Bobby's. But you know what? He has a farm and he grows tofu. Ain't that funny? Never mind. <laughs> it's okay, thanks. Come on, you really think I'm going to let you starve till Sunday? Well, I'm not going to be here for too much longer. Are you okay, Michelle? Aren't you having fun? No, I want to leave this party or whatever it is. I'm supposed to be with my friends at the beach or playing video games with Will. I see what you mean. But the thing is, you'd be the first weirdo who wants to abandon the lock-in. You're already stuck here. Why don't you try and have some fun? I can introduce you to some of my friends. Like my Uncle Bobby always says, just about everywhere has a special horse just waiting for us to ride it. Stop it! We're not friends, loony buffalo girl. Uh, why don't you just leave me alone? Or even better, do me a favor and let me leave this boring lock-in. I'm sorry, Michelle. <laughs> hmm? Sam! Hey, Michelle. I've been looking all over for you. I mean, we were. We've got to get out of here. This is a lock-in, Michelle. You can't leave the gym once you enter. But if you knew that, why did you come in here looking for me? Now you can't leave either. <laughs> well, no biggie. I used to come to lock-ins all the time. Julia came up with the idea years ago. Actually, I met Will at one of these parties. And Tasha. And Lilith. Huh? I won! 
win! I can't believe it! All of you lose to the Kitty Queen! Ha ha ha, losers! Ah. Is that? I think so. And what in the world is she wearing? Can you excuse me for a sec, Sam? Hey, Stella. Hmm. Look, I'm sorry. Mm hmm? You really think I'm gonna let you starve? Huh? <laughs> Wanna know what Looney Buffalo Girl really means? It's a lullaby. My daddy used to sing it to me when I was a baby. Looney Buffalo Girl, don't be afraid. The stars will shine, don't lose your faith. Looney Buffalo Girl, you're my star. I'll keep you safe, both near and far. <laughs> hey guys, how was your weekend? It was awesome! Best weekend ever! Yeah, best weekend for you. I broke my leg the first day. How about you, Michelle? Were you bored? No, it was so much fun! You guys know Buffalo Girl, right? Hiya! Let's go, girls! Hmm? <laughs> hey! I don't carry luggage! <laughs> <laughs> To the P I N Y. Summer is gone. Now that the sun is gone. Days are so long. So many days now. Now we are here. Now that we are here. The world is so clear. I know we all be starting every day with a smile on my face. Come on, let's shake it, go. Come on, let's make it go. Say hi to the P I N Y. And this was inspired by the spring collection from Gina Lovitz. It was very easy to find the perfect tones and... And... Then I put nails in your coffee. So... Is that all you got for me? Well, these are just the sketches. Here, I... Okay, if I'm being honest with you, sweetie, you seem nice and everything, but our magazine needs someone passionate, and you just don't have, you know, what it takes to work for Blitz. Thank you for your time. You don't have what it takes. Who do you think you are, Annie Summers? Ow! Hey, sorry, Michelle. Nice job, dude. Thanks, Sam. But I'm afraid it's not enough. What a mess. Wait, what is that? These are not my... Oh, my God! <sighs> Hi, Blitz Magazine? It's Michelle Fairchild. May I please speak with Annie Summers? Uh-huh. Yeah. Right. Okay. There aren't any appointments available with her for another six months. What am I going to do? Ugh. Seriously, Tasha? You really think I'm going to spend my time designing a robot that does your homework for you? Duh. Don't be such a buzzkill. Michelle. Hmm? Yoo-hoo! Oh, my God. She's here. What you talking about, Mish? Isn't that Annie Summers from Blitz Magazine? There you are. I've been looking for you everywhere. I'm so sorry. I, I tried to call you, but it wasn't my fault. I had a look at your work. This is yours, right? Ugh, thank Dior I found you. I thought I came here for nothing. You've got a good getup and a pretty face. Maybe some blush on your cheeks and you'll be ready. So, do you want to work for me? 
Huh? Well, I think so. I mean, of course I want. It's just I'm... Have you ever starred in a TV show? Uh, no. Well, never mind. Together, we'll make something fabulous. Just imagine it. An ordinary girl becomes the apprentice of one of the best fashion journalists in New York, thanks to a TV show. What do you think? Hmm, it's nice, but what are we talking about? We? Well, you'll just have to wait and see. We'll start recording in a few hours. This is the beginning of your career. Wait, recording? Welcome, everyone. I'm Annie Summers, and this is Hire Me. Oh my god, Lilith, this is unreal. This is so cool. Is this a good idea? No, it's not a good idea. Huh? I better go. Relax. Blitz is a top fashion magazine. And if you're going to be working for Annie, well, you can't just leave. <sighs> you're right. You know, it's the camera. I just need to get used to all of this. No big deal. Hmm. Ah, uh, what is she doing here? The guest is ready. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh. A new way to prove your skills to the public and get the job of your dreams. Oh, I don't get this tiny, tasteless piece of whatever this Shh. is. I'm happy to introduce to you someone who could be the future of Blitz Magazine, Michelle Fairchild. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Hi, Annie. So, what can you tell us about yourself, Michelle? Well, Annie, I'm just an ordinary girl who loves fashion. And what designers inspire you? Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, Julia? Excuse me? Did you say Julia? Sorry, I mean Giulio Ducci, the famous Milanese designer. Definitely a true inspiration. Is there anything you'd like to say to your bark, audience? Bark, 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 bark. Get ready, world, because you're going to get to know the real Michelle. Listen to her. Soon we're going to get to know the real Michelle Fairchild. Let's find out who you really are. We are off the air. Huh? Huh? <laughs> you! Michelle, why didn't you tell me about your best friend, Julia? What? She's not my... Hey, Mimi. I was <sighs> just telling Annie about how your style inspires me. Seriously, Julia? Stop pretending... <sighs> Save your voice for the cameras, Michelle. We don't want to lose our star. I'll make it okay. Doing well, Michelle, but I'm gonna need you to do something a little bit more for the show. But I thought this was the last scene. Well, you know how it is. Just a small last minute problem. I've noticed there's been some tension between you and that blondie. And I must say, she has quite the taste in fashion, like you. So maybe she should take your place. Or maybe you can wipe out your rival. <gasps> but I don't get it. What does this have to do with fashion? This is just part of the business, Michelle. If you really want to work for me, you need to start thinking about your professional career. Think about it. Baby, you're my baby. <laughs> you know, if I were you, I would plot so many pranks to use on Julia. I shouldn't have to do this. Not even Julia deserves this. And you know what? I'm not going to. Hmm? Hmm? What does she think she's doing? 
And look who we have here. What's going on, Julia? You really thought you were the only star in this show, Mimi? But... Oh, please, don't fool yourself. You really think I was here just to be behind the cameras? Julia, come on, not now. Why not? It's the perfect time. You want to know who Michelle really is? Why don't you tell the cameras about where you're really from, hmm? Mm. And how you're ashamed of your father? Stop it, Julia! Oh, and why don't you tell them how you and your friends sneaked into my bedroom and pranked me like a child while I was sleeping? You want the spotlight? Is that it? Then take it. It's yours. I don't want it anymore. But just do me a favor. <laughs> leave me alone. Do whatever you have to do. But get out of my life! Hey! What? Julia, I didn't... You! Uh, this is better uh, than I ever imagined. Wonderful job, Michelle. I, I... You planned all of this? No, Julia, no. It wasn't intentional. She... <laughs> I knew you'd do the right thing, Michelle. The right thing? And what would you know about that? I always thought that working with you was my dream. But now that you've shown your true colors, I think I'd rather be on my own than be around people like you. <laughs> hey, Julia. Get out of here! Please, Julia, I just... Look. We're not friends, uh, and we honestly can't even stand each other. So don't try to be nice to me now. Maybe you win this time, but mark my words. You will never do something like that to me again. Uh, uh, stop it, Julia. Why can't we just forgive each other? I'm so sick of this. Too late. Daddy, I'm really upset. I need to see you. 